Hello everyone, welcome back to some more CBG, and uh, alright, we're going to start up Evo Land 2, and we're just going to go on a grand old adventure. Yeah. Hello? Daily training session, oh, okay. Cool. Okay. Congratulations, G. All right. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Look farther. Oh, look! Trees! I want to cut them down. <gasps> yeah? Feel all... <laughs> yeah. Yeah! Oh, he's got a nice swing. Okay. As a reward, we'll put some relaxing music. Nice. Yeah, I do. This sounds like some good old-fashioned Game Boy music. Okay, cool. Oops, our apologies, a computer. <laughs> oh, Arcturus. Ooh, this is much more smoother than the first one. Oh yeah. Ah, I hit him in the butt. <laughs> Um, sure. Hi. So that's him, huh? He passed all the tests with flying colors. Just right for the task, trusting to him. Okay. Oh. Uh. We checked, double check. Everything will be will proceed as planned. Okay. Um Good Good Yeah. Yes, Professor. And I'm just like, what the hell's going on? So if you don't remember for, uh, Evil Land 1, or if you've never seen any Evil Land games and this is your first video with me, welcome! Evil Land is somewhere... A long time ago, the Magi civiliz civilization had discovered great secrets. Oh, this music. Ooh, no one knows how exactly, but it disappeared soon after that. Marking the beginning of a new era. Whoa. In year 950, humans and demons fought a merciless war. The human Empire won at great cost. I don't know who that is, but he looks cool on the right, and the beast dude on the left looks really awesome, too. <clears throat> Fifty years later, the city of Genova <laughs> is preparing the rem remembrance ceremony of the victory. Oh, look, it's in the shape of the sword. Uh-oh. But not everything is as peaceful as it seems. Um... But yeah, you start off in, like, a very heavily pixelated, uh, state. And then, um... As you play the game, it progresses to better graphics. Oh, you're awake! Are you feeling better? Huh? My father found you passed out 
deep in the uh, forest. You don't remember anything? Not even your name? Maybe if you wandered around the forest, that would help jog your memory. By the way, I didn't introduce myself. My name is... I'll stay with Fina. That looks pretty good. I hope you remember everything quickly. Thanks, Fina. Okay, see. So you... okay. Oh, no sword? Or unless you can't use, like, a fire. Mm-hmm. Alright. I guess you can't... Oh, no, we don't even have a sword. Oh, okay. Ugh. I have a thing for mustaches. Oh, okay, well, let's... Uh, I'm gonna guess the forest is up here. There are strange beings that exist out of time. Oh. Oh. I have no idea. I am wandering around. Because it looks like we're starting off with Super Nintendo graphics. I mean, technically, we started off with the whole Game Boy. But... Okay. I mean, I, I, I like how smoothly this game is working now. Uh, it, I mean, the last time, it was... Last game, it was like a little bit choppier, but I mean, I don't know. That was probably just like a, an experiment in gaming or something like that. So this looks like it's going to run much better. Okay, so obviously we gotta go to the forest. Oh. Boy, I wish I had a sword to where I could just chop all this shit down. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, let's see here. Where's the store at? No, seriously, where where's the store at? I have no idea. Hello? Nah, you guys have enough wood? Eh. Alright. There's the inn. Ah, weapons. A sword on a nice sign like that is an international sign for weapons. So. Yes. Okay. Old man pole. <laughs> Dr. Pole? Okay, but watch yourself. He's not the most easygoing sort, especially if you bother him. He's fishing. Okay. We're looking for somebody that's fishing. Which means he's got to be near Wata. Ah! That must be him. What's going on, dude? What a nice day to fish in peace, with nobody around to bug me. Well, almost nobody. What? The key to the old house? Mm, I might have it or not, it depends. How about you do me a favor and rec- Oh, uh, already fetch quests? I uh, fish uh, I can't seem to solve. Could help me out, okay. Oh, God. We're all tangled up. I can't tell one from another. Okay. I'd say two. Uh, 
Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ugh. That was a stupid fucking mini game. Alright. Okay, so let's. We gotta go to the northeast of the village. Let's go on. Let's try to leave. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, let's go, Galley. Hey, you know what? That may have been the reason why I couldn't. Couldn't get in there, yeah. There's a chest over here. Oh, I found 50 bucks. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, we got an old sword. <laughs> Hoping it doesn't shatter on the first blow. They can't charge it up or anything like that. It's like, man, as soon as we get a weapon, all right, here comes all the bad guys. Get over here. All right. <laughs> all right, cool. So now we got a sword. I can fight things. can leave. Hopefully. Hopefully it's not like, oh, you're gonna have a shield first. It's like, yeah. Oh, no. Thank God. I'm guessing we're going up here. It'd be nice if we had like a spin attack or something. I can't go over here, can I? Okay, no. Okay. You. <laughs> I am the sword master. All right. Yeah, we can get gold that way. Hell yeah. By the way, guys, again, once again, this is all blind. I have no idea where I'm going. So I remember the first time I ever saw Evil Land was a, a friend of mine, Israel Mania. He he was playing this game. And it just looked like fun. Of course, whenever I saw it, it was like a year or two before I even played it, so I didn't remember anything. But I do remember it, it just looked like fun. Well, so far the sword is holding up real good. What are these gems that I'm collecting? I'm I'm getting a lot of them. Ow. Ow! He farted on me, asshole. 
All right, so is there like multiple ways to go? Okay, there is, but I don't think I can go that way quite yet. So, we shall go this way. Oh no! Fina, what the hell are you doing up here? Help! None of you motherfuckers fart on me! Ah, you're safe now. Usually I can manage on my own just fine. I just so happen... Uh, but it just so happens that I HATE MUSHROOMS! Anyway, thanks for your help. Uh, still can't remember your name, huh? Can you? Uh... It'll be temporary, of course, for as long as it takes for you to remember. <gasps> well, remember it all. <gasps> Let's see, your name could be... Kuro, huh? Not Clink? Ah, or Clank, or whatever. I want to be the another adventure of Clank. Or Clink, or whatever the fuck his name was. There's a little power in there. Cool! Now we're gonna find out why all those monsters appeared recently. Yay! Yes! Fina has joined the team. Awesome. <coughs> All right, cool. We got Fina to join us. I'm guessing she's a mage and she can just zap these things out of existence. All right, cool. What'd you have in mind? Yeah. Obviously. Try folks and I'll come help you. Okay. <laughs> oh. oh, okay, cool. All right, cool. We'll just let her rest for a minute. Let's go. Let's go exploring. Oh, okay, cool. That's like... Okay, I see now. They, they have gems for experience points. That's awesome. Ooh, there's a squirrel. Conker, what are you doing over here? He's a little nutty. Oh, man, I need a shield. I guess that thing over there was a save. Yeah. All right. Ah, another squirrel! Don't you throw your nuts at me! <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Yay! Mindlessly killing everything we see! <laughs> okay, that looks important, so I'm gonna... I saw an alternate way. Uh, I'm gonna go check that out first. See if there's like more bad guys or yeah, more bad. Oh, a chest. You got a green goo. Ah, sticky. Ugh. I have no idea what green goop is for, but all right. Uh, where my dad found you. Okay, cool. Careful. I see some demons in the clearing. That's a great question. I really should have saved. Oh. Is that it? 
Sure, are you sure that's really a megalith? Professor Giro's writings are unambiguous. If we activate this megalith, we'll be able to tap into great amounts of magi energy. It's a megalith, alright. I saw one just like it years ago. But that one was broken. Oh no. Here's records. The energy within the forest guardian would be enough to trigger it. Guardian's been long dormant, so it must be in a weakened state. We should have no trouble whatsoever defeating it. Okay, Cherry. <laughs> Mary Cherry, like Cherry plays. <laughs> Soon I'll have my revenge on those wretched humans. Oh. Prepare to summon the Guardian. Uh oh. This is awful. If they wake the Forest Guardian, it might attack my village. We've got to do something. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, it's the Guardian! It's awake! It wear itself out destroying the village. We'll return. Oh, crap. Yeah, I agree. Oh, yeah, I really should have. My ass kicked! <laughs> oh, okay, cool. Ah, he didn't even hit me that time. Man, I'm like constantly getting hit. Oh, no, I killed him, but he, he killed me first. I'm just gonna do this. I'm just gonna run around. Let him spit out his little orbs. Hopefully not get killed. Scene saved me. Yay! But it's also bad. <laughs> oh crap. Ooh, lots of experience. Yay! Oh, thank god. I like, I kind of like this grinding system. Oh boy. Is that what those demons were talking about? There's something written on here. There's dollar sit a man. Uh-oh. It's glowing. What the heck? <gasps> Portal time! Oh, that's awesome. Uh 
the hell? I feel different. Let's detail. <laughs> yep. Now where are we? But there's something different. Yeah, there's something different. Those demons put my village at risk. Okay, guys, that's going to do it for this episode and the next episode. Uh, <laughs> this is going to be good. All right, I'll see you all then.